What's up everybody, it's Critical. I've been getting a lot of messages over the last couple of months asking me about how my situation's been going. Since the last life update video I made, I was in a pretty rough spot. So I just wanted to make a quick video talking about that. First things first, I just wanted to thank you to everyone that sent me a message offering me support or just being there for me. I really, really appreciated that. So I think the biggest question I've been asked recently is why did I make my Snapchat public? And I just did it because I thought it would be fun. I've never really been against showing my face, I just don't want to do it on YouTube in a face cam because I just don't like that shit. I feel it's unnecessary and doesn't really add too much, so I just, I don't want to do face cams. But when I'm just in the musical zone where I'm just playing a beautiful symphony on the marvelous woodwind recorder, I don't mind people being able to look at my face and look into my eyes and see the jubilation that I'm feeling as I'm putting this masterfully crafted piece of plastic in my mouth and gently blowing into it. And also, I was kind of hoping maybe it would inspire other people who are at a very low point in their lives to go out and enjoy themselves and make the most of a shitty situation. If they could see me having a decent time, maybe they'd be like, oh, well, shit, this fucking guy over here, he's, he's having a shitty time at the moment, but look at him now, it looks like he's having fun. Maybe I should go out of my way and have some fun. I don't know, I'm having a hard time putting that into words, but that's why I made my Snapchat public. And also, with the footage in the background, you can tell my character is a gorilla. But I also figured out if you take the clothes off of any male character, they also become a gorilla, so I thought I would just point that out. So the next thing I've been getting asked about is the job situation. I still don't have a real job, but I've been doing freelance voice acting for a while, and that's been picking up a lot recently, which is really cool and has been helping me out a lot. One of the bigger projects I've been a part of is coming out soon. I, I talked about it about a year ago called Anima Gate of Memories, so I'm going to go ahead and show a clip from that. So, you were able to open a pathway to the foundation of the tower, where not even I could go. I was wondering when you would show up. I guess that somehow, now you know what Arcane is. What's really happening in this place, could you tell me? I play the dude with the mask there, Zero. Now a lot of people have asked me what happened to Hotfeed since the website's not up anymore. And it's because all of us that worked on it started to go through some shit that made it hard for us to keep up with the website. And we just didn't pay the $40 to renew it. It was a lot of fun to work on and it's really sad that we just, it, the situation didn't work out where we could keep working on it. So okay. just kind of a shame because I know all of us enjoyed working on that site. Um, now overall I'd say everything's improved since the last update. And a lot of that's because of all of your support, and that's being 100% honest. I've been feeling like shit for a while, but every time I would get like a really sweet message through email or on Snapchat, it just meant a lot to me, so thank you so, so much. And also, like I said, I'm not a positive thinker, or at least I never have been until recently, and that's been really helping me out a lot. I've been just enjoying myself regardless of how I've been feeling, and that's just been making me super optimistic about the future. So hopefully anyone else that's been going through a really shitty time like I have will listen to my dogs bark and know that I love my dogs, but I don't like when they bark. I fucking love my doggies. Love to see them when I come home for Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving to everyone, by the way. Now, like I was saying, I to anyone out there that's been feeling as shitty as I have been recently, just know that it's going to get better. It just takes a little bit of time. And it also helps to just keep your head up and not worry about the future and just focus on staying happy in the present. Just do what makes you happy at the moment. That really helps a lot. Now my friend, who's been obsessed with making shirts since he made the Hot Feed shirt a, uh, a little while back, made a fuckload of shirts, so I'll go ahead and show those here. If any of these are interesting to you or you want them, I'm going to go ahead and place a link in the description. The link will take you to the Christmas shirt, and then from there, if you click on the storefront, it has all the other ones. Now the shirts are going to stay up on the Teespring storefront, except for the Christmas one, so if you're ever interested in getting a shirt, that's where you can go to get one. Now I've saved the most important question for last, which is, how many recorders do I own? And right now I only own two recorders sadly, but I plan on traveling the world and collecting a recorder from each place I visit. I want some real fucking rare recorders. I want a fucking recorder that the Mayans used to use to fucking tame bears or something. I want a collection of exotic recorders, but right now I only have two. I actually have more puppy slippers than I do recorders. I have four pairs of puppy slippers because I keep getting dirty and I have to keep going to Walmart and buying $5 pair of puppy slippers, but they're worth it. So yeah, I just made this to give a quick update on my situation since a lot of people have been asking how that's going and also just to answer some questions I've been getting asked a lot. 
So thank you all again for all the support and helping me get through a really shit situation. And to everyone else that's been feeling really shitty and have shit feelings going on right now, just know that it really will get better if you just stay strong and just give it time. So, yeah, that's about it. See ya.